In the spirit of spooky season, we have brought in an expert to help us figure out what's to come in the NBA season. Audrey Wells from Psychic Awakenings in West Hills is here to help us learn more about the NBA and ourselves. So please introduce yourself, Audrey. Give us a little background on you. Oh, Lord. Hi, everyone. Thank you for inviting me for the show. I am Audrey Wells. I have been doing this for over 22 years. I do palm, psychic tarot. I do past life regression. I also do some chakra balancing. OK. Ooh. I don't know what none of that means, but it sounds like you're a professional. 22 <laughs> years in the game. So Nick and Kenyon will be asking questions about the NBA while Rashad and Gil will participate in a yeah. palm reading. So Nick, please go over there. I got to be first? Yeah, got to be no, first. No, no. Come yes, on, man. man. I'm scared of this type of shit. No. <laughs> the and people forces get the way, you man. The way your life going, man, you might need some. Something. I got a job, man. <laughs> I got a I job, got a job. Now. I work I work. I work with you. <laughs> I'm not talking no more. <laughs> eye to eye. Oh, no, I got to sit at the table. I won't bite, I promise. All right, man. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, well, Nick, Nick, have at it. Damn, my knees hurt. Um... <laughs> All right. There's only one question he got to ask. Just one question, Nick. <laughs> Am I really gay? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to hit him. Yeah. He might not get the look answer he wants. So I get one question? Yeah, Nick, like oh, as many as you want. Yeah, yeah he is. Um, a yeah. I want to know, um, will yeah, the yeah. Lakers win a championship this year? Will Bradley <laughs> score more than? 30 points this year. We'll probably score more than 30 points this year. <laughs> In a game, okay. one game. More than 30 points? 30 plus. Yes, but not towards the end of the season, I don't feel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, good. <laughs> do my woman love me? Because she's been taking all my money for a long time, so I want to just make sure it's more than love. Oh. No, she, I feel she does love you. Okay. I feel she does love you. And the thing is, you're a very loyal person. You're a good, you're an honest person, and she is very lucky to have you. <laughs> you know what? No, it's not. That's probably the best thing I ever did. She's I very hope you lucky see to it. have you. I hope you, you see it. <laughs> she needs to appreciate you a little bit more, though, let's both be honest. I knew you was but the one God you. sent for me today. <laughs> I knew it. Was God the, sent, God knew sent this. That's... You're a good person, you're a loyal person, and I'm going to be very honest. When people need help, you're always there to help them. Thank always. You. Appreciate you. God has blessed you in prepared. so many ways. You know that. Yeah. But it's okay for you to take a little time off for you. That's okay to do. Right. You know that, right? Yeah. It's hard, though, sometimes. <laughs> it is. I'm trying to be real, because they looking at me. I know they do. They don't like this energy you're giving me. But <laughs> you're I've, been, I've been dealing with you're that just, all my life. Okay, your persona, you want to act crazy. You have to show them that, you know, you're the fun guy. But no one realizes how sensitive you truly are. No oh. one knows how deep down what you've been through. Yeah, they don't. Oh. No, but, and no one realizes how good of a person you truly are. Oh. Thanks. And she is lucky to have you. Remember oh. that. Not the opposite way around. Ooh. I don't want no more questions. Thank you. Good job, Nick. No, for real. Thank you so much. Nice Seriously. Oh, oh validated. Oh, man. Validated. Thank you. Oh. It's my turn? This is probably the best moment I had on this show. My turn? <laughs> oh, no, okay. oh. You look like you've been doing some push-ups, man. <laughs> they got a buff over the weekend. Oh. Yeah. Gil, how'd you feel about uh, Nick's reading? He gonna Love hate. You. Okay. Don't like... say nothing. Okay. Don't, Don't say nothing. Doors coming up. She gonna read the pun. Yeah. All right, just making sure. Now let's send Kenyon over there. Ooh. Oh, Lord. To get some brother NBA knowledge. fortune. <laughs> Brother, <laughs> brother, knowledge and the knowledge. That's the actual knowledge. Brother, knowledge and the knowledge. <laughs> they gonna tell her her poem in a minute. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Let me tell you about your life. You know what I'm so saying? You... <laughs> yeah. Let me tell you. Ain't hey, nothing serious on nah, this nah, damn nah. show, man. <laughs> nah, turn your goddamn hands over. <laughs> so I can read now, <laughs> right now. <laughs> Okay. Like to select yourself first? Yes, this, this, man. These Go dudes, ahead. man. Breathe. Ready? Little namaste? Yeah. So let's... Um, I hate y'all. Let's get serious Yeah, now. so we're an NBA family. Um, have to do with my son, KJ. Like, how will his career pan out? Will he mm. become who he's supposed to be? Or will he... That's tough. Fizzle out. How old is he? 23. 
and then B not playing back to back. I'm going to be very honest with you. He has a very successful career coming up. Mm. And sorry to say, he's going to outlight you a lot. Oh, sweet. Outlight you a lot. Oh, I love it. So you're going to be a very proud papa. All right. And LeBron Jr. is going to be having some uh, competition in the future. I will tell you that one. And hey, let's get it. Fair. So he better watch out. Sorry. I know LeBron James might be watching this, but, you hey. know, he's got some competition. Yeah, right. they all Lakers are great, okay. Hey, hush you, boy. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel a very, I feel a very successful career. I he's know, definitely the right path. Some over there. He's a good boy. Well, Already. You should be very proud. Oh, I am. <laughs> yes. Josiah, be quiet. <laughs> I'm helping her with her evaluation. <clears throat> well, her mouth Next guy up, is, more. This is Larry Cemetery. Over Sean McCants, you're going to receive a live palm reading. You can bring your work with you if you feel so inclined. Or uh, work on the couch. Shit. If you want to go solo, dolo. Might as well. You always have to go with the work, huh? Yeah, man. <laughs> shit, she got work pay. number she two. She got to pay. She paying. Brother Am I reading is you or reading the doll? Which one? Hold huh? on. Brother Am I reading is you or the mommy. doll? No, this is just my assistant. <laughs> Work number two. <clears throat> All right, you ready? Mm hmm. All right. Now, before we get started, what is your name and date of birth? Or just your name, because I know privacy maybe. Which name? The name you was born with. Rashad. I got a little energy over there. McCants. Um. Rashad, it shows here that you're a very old soul. Do you understand what reincarnation is? Mm hmm You've been reincarnated over a dozen times. Mm-hmm. The past couple of years, you found yourself very strong spiritually. The past few years, you've grown to just finally be at peace, finally find within yourself. Next year is going to be a very big year for you. Next year is going to be a big year financially, emotionally, spiritually, but also within love and relationship. I do see some, there's going to be, are you trying to start your own business or invest in something right now? Mm -hmm. It's going to be very successful. Hmm. Do you mind if I ask what it is? Yeah, it's a mental health foundation. It's going to be very successful. I feel it's going to help a lot of people, but also bring you a lot of peace, a lot of joy, and I feel like this is what you're... Your work on this world was not to, you know, be an NBA player or do this or be an icon. You were here to help people. God has given you all of this so you could give back. And I feel you are on the right path of all of this. Now, what questions do you have? <sighs> How long am I going to be single for? <laughs> you sure we should talk about that on the air? Should we go one-on-one -on -one separately? On the air. On we are they here now. Know. They want to know. <laughs> you need to hear for I we see next year is going to be someone coming into your life. I, I see finally, let's be honest, you haven't had the best of luck when it comes to love. But next year, I finally feel you finding that individual, mm. finding that person. You had to go through on this spiritual journey because you weren't ready for this person. She's been waiting for you, though. Mm. But you weren't. Mm. You had a lot of healing that needed to happen. Next year is the year you finally having that peace, finally connecting with your true flame. The well, last question is, is she some work or not? No. <laughs> no. Sorry, ladies. Sorry to disappoint everyone, but it's not from work. Okay. Not <laughs> she says, you're going to get a real girl. That ain't what he meant. That ain't what he meant. Thank you. You're going to get a real one, okay? Yeah, get it. Yeah. Ah, yes. No work from work, shot. HR Let's go, proud. Gil Butts. <laughs> Go turn. Last but not least, we have our show's namesake, Gilbert Arenas. Okay. Oh, Lord. I hope it's some good news. Man. Up to the stage. I hope you don't go to jail or no shit she say you go locked up, dude. <laughs> the show is over. So don't tell us no bad shit. Don't tell us they're putting out guns no more. <laughs> thank you for inviting me to your show. Oh, thank you. You ready, Gil? Mm hmm Oh, man, I got some bad shit. Oh. No, I'm <laughs> Gil, what is your first and last name? First and last name? Mm -hmm. Gilbert Arenas. Gil, it shows here you have a very long and a very successful life. I see you living over 87 years old. 
Growing up for you, you went through a lot of trials and a lot of tribulations. But these trials and tribulations, they made you stronger. They made you better. This year has been a very powerful year for you. Actually, the past three years have been very powerful for you. You've grown a lot as a person, emotionally, mentally, spiritually. And I do have to say this. I know before we weren't going to talk about love, but you met your soulmate. You met the person you're supposed to be with. How long have you two been together? Is he uh, my dog? Oh, uh, uh, I was okay, no. <laughs> but a year and some change. This woman is perfect for you. You met your other half. She made you a better man. And now it's time for you to just <clears throat> live your happily ever after. I have to tell you that. I do see that there is going to be a few investments that are coming in. Not next year. Next year is not a good year for investing. Mm -hmm. 2026, I do see there's going to be some opportunities. I do want you to take those opportunities, though. Now, what questions do you have? Okay, before, you know, I get married, I got one task. <clears throat> What's my chances of uh, having a sexual relation with uh, Nick Young's girlfriend? <laughs> Who? He said mine? Huh? No. You what? know, Melly, Melly paid for her. Well, what look, look what card came up for you right in the middle. This is that, death? That's not going to happen. That, that idea died. Ah! It said today. <laughs> that idea died. Get that out of your head. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Thank you, Psych. <laughs> I, I was really hoping too. <laughs> I, was really, I was really hoping too. Uh, Hey, All right. hey, be a good boy. Okay. Be a good boy. Man, I thought I seen your car you come out the drive. Dang, nigga, I thought I had one over you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I think Melly slipped, slipped her a hundred dollar bill on the way up here. Oh, I thought she was going to say the good news, man. Man, you was a lucky man. You have it for the right price. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's <laughs> give it up one more time for, right, for RG Wells for Psychic Awakening. <laughs> Make me an offer. Make me an offer. She could be, she could be wrong. The psychic nah. could be wrong. Nah, you know she said I mean. she pulled out death. I'm dead, dead. Yeah, I'm you know, dead. motherfucker. Chitty, yeah. chitty, 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 bang, bang. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang. <laughs> Everybody in the chat wanted me to get my palms red, too, but my palms are ashy right now. He so gonna kill me? You're not gonna get a clear vision of what's... So that's, my, that's my wife. <laughs> palms are ashy, Audrey. Thank you. Thank you for making them stop. <laughs> Hopefully the chat stops packing me up. That's all I wish for in my future. But how'd y'all feel about your psychic reading? Oh, you put Miss Cleo to shame. I'm gonna let you know. Yeah. Call me now. <laughs> Call me down. One eight hundred. Confirmation. Oh, okay. Ooh. Yeah. Right. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You know, when you got special powers, some things are just connected and stars align, and you just see the path. You just go with it. You know, that's how it all go. It's like when we all connected. We all connect for a reason. It's like, man, follow it. That man said, come do a podcast. Bet. I don't know what it's going to be. Bet. <laughs> right? Bet. I don't know what it's going to be. <laughs> Just come on. Just come fuck that. Bet. So, yeah, I mean, everything she said aligned perfectly. So, I mean, it's only going to get better. So, Gil, we, we heard you ask if you're going to have sexual relations. When... So you keep bringing shit up like this. Cause you <laughs> he did it. Like, nah. Don't make me go to the car. Love it, love it, don't make me go to the car. Love it, love it. I'm going to be Gil today now. <laughs> I'm going to get Gil. I'm going to the car. Don't get me. Go to the car. Get my other one. Let me go to the car. Don't get my other one. I'm Gil today. Now, let me keep talking about my woman. I'm going to the car. Okay? I apologize. I was just he recapping. Just, I was just acting like because we were passing around my hoe. I mean, my woman y'all talking about. Okay? This is mine. <laughs> yeah, it's, hey, she confirmed. It's yours. I thought it was ours, but it's yours. <laughs> All right? You know, so officially, I'm, I'm gone. Thank you. I'm out of here. Can you I'll stop DMing her when you leave the house. Damn. Damn. I'll stop. I'll stop, I'll stop, I'll stop no. sending good morning, queen. I'll stop. I'll stop. I'm out. I'm good officially morning, done. Queen paper is trail sick. gone. No more paper trail. Good morning, trail. queen is sick. Good morning, oh. queen. <laughs> Grand risings. Grand risings, my queen. Oh, my queen. <laughs> Can you, you asked about KJ's future. Were you happy with what you heard? Absolutely. We happy, too. Absolutely. Yeah, I felt some good energy over there. I ain't gonna lie. It was really... You were emotional leaving the chair. She made me feel good. 
I'm gonna just kind of. Hey, what's her IG, man? Let's put her IG in the chat, man. Yeah, everybody right can follow that. Yeah, get nice. some bread. Like, get, wait, get your bread up. As much as I tried to play, she was hitting me with some good stuff. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you, so I respect that. So man. again, we uh, appreciate you to Audrey Wells from Psychic Awakenings here in West Hills, and I appreciate all you, gentlemen. Huh? Damn, that shit got my head sweaty and shit. God the IG damn. is psychic underscore Wagner. Go ahead, give her a follow. Uh, break some bread. She will tell you your future as well. Hopefully, it's what you want to hear. But like, this, it, like and subscribe. Was this your first time getting your palm yeah. ring? Nah. You got your palm ring before? Yeah. It's no way. I'm a psychic, bro. <laughs> no, not you. you <coughs> well, you do palm ring. That, I said, did you get yours red? If you're a psychic, you do it. You do I the do it. I do it. I get mine to see if they're real psychics or not. <laughs> so did you get yours? So that was your first time then? No. Oh, okay, okay. I was born doing this. <laughs> I feel you. The doctor read my palm. The doctor was looking at my palm. Like, when I came back, he was like, mm hmm. You got psychic and brother knowledge. What you think? Okay. <laughs> you said psychic underscore what? Uh, awakening. awakening. Nah, I've so, always been scared of that type of stuff. Me too. I don't like play when with the you. ladies walk up to you and just. Stop talking, leaders, man. I listen. I see some dangerous. I'm like, what the fuck wrong with you? <laughs> but listen, it, right? better listen. I get it, what, but she see it. It's on your shoulder. She telling yeah, you. Yeah, I see something on it in your life. <laughs> no, psychic, not psychic. Yeah, psychic awakening. Not psychic. Get, get away from me. Right? Get away from it's me. You. <laughs> it's you. It's you. Like that, have that ever happened to one of y'all? Just yeah. walking down the street like somebody? I was, I was walking on the street, had a psychic walk up to me, said, thinner. Damn. But I knew, I knew it was full of shit because it didn't work. I knew it was full of shit because it didn't work. <laughs> Here we are today. Shout out to all the big people out there. Shout out to all the big that people is. out there. I was hoping you can't, you're not supposed to eat the whole pie, bro. Just right. a bite. You ate the whole pie. He said, Dinner. He said it's not working, man. Dinner. I thought it was working. This, how many times have you nice try. Shit? Nice try, sir. But again, appreciate y'all. This was Larry Cemetery in the show. They appreciate everybody.